first chapter didn't like the art, and the progression was predictable. Ho 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 ho. Even a five year old could put together her having a boyfriend and her marrying the K pop star was contradicting. Ho 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 ho. Felt like standard cookie cutter shoujo manga quality, so dropped on the first chapter. <coughs> Yaho, 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 and what is up, YouTube? My name is Sifa Yankee. In today's video, we're going to be talking about a manha called So I Married the Anti Fan. First things first, this is not a manga. Manga are produced by Japanese illustrators, manha are produced by Korean illustrators. That whole comment, oh, the shoujo manga, <laughs> this guy doesn't even know what he's reading. And I'm gonna tell you something about this manha. I think you should give it a shot. And why? Because it's predictable. Because it's corny, because it's dumb, and because it's cute. But hear me out on this. You're gonna get a view into the culture of Korea. And that's what you wanna read Korean manha for. You wanna see into the lifestyle of the imagination of Korean people. And this is not like a solo leveling kind of thing. This is like an actual like, real life taking place you're going to see what people actually interact like in these illustrations i don't know if they're super accurate with actual koreans but you're going to get a point of view from a character in korea the point of view of an anti-fan not a fan and i don't remember the last time i had an anti-fan we called them trolls on twitch but trolls are not anti-fans trolls are like malevolent anti-fans are just like no nah, no no don't get popular and I'm not gonna give any spoilers to the manhog because I want to get you in there with a fresh impression, but this is what I am gonna do for you. I'm gonna read the description of the manhog. The romance between famous K-pop star Ku Jun and his official anti-fan reporter Lee Gun Young, who end up cohabitating? Actually, I think that is like the perfect way to sum up what this manhog is gonna be about. You already know the storyline. You already know what's going to happen. You're reading it with an expectation to get a certain storyline, but you just don't know the semantics and the stuff that's going to happen inside of that story. That's the way I come at reading anything online. And it is, and yeah, everybody, that's the video for today. If you like this video, don't forget to smash that like button. Tell me how I'm doing. Give me a comment. Tell me what kind of content you want to see me do and provide for you because you know i really do want to get back into youtube and i really do want to create good content for you guys i'll see you all in the next video bye bye